guys. Nothing like having a desk in the woods. Bobby, where are you going? What the heck? You're just trying to leave me? Do a pie. Yeah. to do for 15 minutes. That's like the longest wait time I've had for one of these. On the menu for dinner tonight. Bobby, what do we do for 15 minutes? You guys, the bugs here are no que bueno, okay? They're not fun. They're buzzing around a little bit too much for my comfort. Um, yeah, you guys know how I feel about that. So. Should probably light another mosquito thingy. You guys need these if you don't have them. They are beautiful. An invention sent straight from heaven, you feel me? If you don't like bugs like me, you're gonna thrive with these little cones. Okay, left hand, get a grip. Well, I guess we can make Blue a happy for 15 minutes. You know what I mean? Drop. He's obviously feeling better, you guys. Pretty much back to normal. I haven't been wrapping his wounded paw pad at all. I've just been cleaning it and putting triple antibiotic ointment on it and just like leaving it out with some airflow, if you know what I mean. Like I said, it's the paw pad that's like up here. It's not the one that's on the bottom of his foot, so it's not like he's stepping on it every day. And he seems to be thriving, so I think we're doing pretty good most athletic pup there is. Wait, where are you going? Oh, are you going potty? Got it. Good boy. Do you guys have like radars for your dog? I swear I know everything Blue's about to do. Before he's about to go to the bathroom, before he's about to throw up. I can tell when Blue's about to throw up like 10 minutes before it happens. Like I swear I have mommy intuition for my dog. I can tell when he's about to bark. Come on. Come on. Bubba, you only have about 10 minutes left. Drop. Noise. Do you guys want to see how Blue catches? Okay, come here. Drop. Bubby. 
<laughs> An athlete. Wow. <laughs> you got some air on that one. Grace ya. Uh-huh, I won. Uh, definitely hasn't been 15 minutes, but I'm gonna go ahead and check this dinner because I'm impatient. Let's do it. Give it a whirl. Ooh, it's soupy. I feel like I added too much water. Yeah, I definitely added too much water because now this is bland <laughs> and we can't have that. Where are my seasonings? Garlic and herb, garlic, salt, pepper. Let's do it. We're getting somewhere. Well, we all know I'm not a chef. <laughs> Cue any single cooking video I have on this channel and that'll tell you what, what kind of skills I've got here. Better. Better. Baby, go drink your water. You guys, Blue started doing this thing recently. I don't know if it's like a bid for a... <clears throat> I'm like inhaling this. I don't know if it's like a bid for attention or something. <laughs> like, I couldn't tell you why, but he started doing this thing where he won't drink water unless I'm holding his water dish. Like, I, I can tell he's dying of thirst. He's been playing fetch for like, you know, 20 minutes or whatever. He's dead. Won't even walk because he's so tired. And I'll be like, drink your water. And then he'll just look at it and look back at me. And then if I pick it up and put it in front of him and hold the dish, then he'll drink for like... A minute straight. I'm like, make it make sense, kid. So yeah, that's what's going on with Blue these days. Healing paw pad won't drink water unless it's held for him. Chili Mac. I'm not going to lie to you guys, this is pretty good. This Chili Mac is making me sweat. <laughs> Which is probably bringing the bugs closer to me too. It is what it is. Oh, by the way you guys, we're in state number two now. We made it to... Oregon is so pretty and I look like a grease ball because I'm sweating we're in the woods between the coast and like the next major city and um, <laughs> it's a little hot here it's a little hot I think tomorrow is supposed to be even hotter so we're gonna we're gonna figure out how we uh, we deal with that anyways we'll survive somehow but yeah you girls sweaty I love Oregon though it was one of my favorite places the first time I did the 50 state road trip. So relaunching it and being here kind of again, like Washington is just super exciting. I'm glad to be back. Love the Pacific Northwest. What do I need to do when I'm here, you guys? Okay, 
I gotta, I gotta stop walking and talking. I'm like looking for a place to set the camera down. I don't know that I'll be able to do this. Don't fall, okay guys? But yeah, I love it here. I need to know what I should do when in Oregon. So any of the Oregon people, Oregonites, Oregon donors, Oregon, Oregon, Oregon. Why am I saying Oregon? Oregon. <laughs> I have no oxygen to my brain right now. The Oregon people, whatever you call yourselves. Um, what should I do here? Because there's... I know of a couple places I have to go just because I've been there before and I love them. So I want to go back, like Cannon Beach and Multnomah Falls. I'll definitely be going to those two places, but as far as other things, let me know because I'm going to be here a while, you know what I mean? So I need to know where else to go that's worth it. Right, Bubby? Bubby, where do you want to go? like back to where my ball is <laughs> you guys should I go Sasquatch hunting here I don't know I kind of feel like I should oh can you sit can you sit oh my goodness are you excited to be in Oregon Bubby are you just along for the ride here do you want to tell everybody how your paw's better? Yeah. He's trying to understand me. Bubby, you want to tell them about your paw? <laughs> is your paw feeling better? Bub, is your paw feeling better? <laughs> Actually, let's check it out really quick. Yep, it's looking better. It's honestly uh, healing quite nicely, so. I'd say we did a pretty good job, pup. You're definitely hyper again, so. Feeling back to normal. Blue. <laughs> the best boy. I'm so glad you're feeling better, bub. I was very worried. Does that look low to you guys? I feel like my tire's low. Compared to like, yeah, that's low. And that's why we always carry these portable tire inflators, because holy cow, I was at an 18. That's half the amount I should really have in my tire. Oh, I don't know what's going on with bruised tires. I probably need new tires, new brakes, new transmission. Just like casual, you know, like no big deal. 
no biggie. Also, you guys, I've been pulling ticks off of blue today in this campsite, so that's super fun. My biggest fear in life is probably ticks, so it's been it's been going well. Yeah. I think we're going to call it an early night tonight, seeing as we are in tick country, and I'm just not a fan. I'm not trying to stay out here and give them more opportunities. You know what I'm saying? Blue's fine. He's on monthly tick prevention, and he also gets sprayed with this flea and tick preventative spray, too. So he's fine, but um, seeing as he could bring them into the car and then they could get on me in my sleep... I can't think about that too hard. That's going to freak me out, okay? Um, I just, I, I'm just going to hit the hay early here. Go in the car early and get some work done. Because staying out here isn't my jam. You know what I'm saying. These ticks can all get bent, quite honestly. The sun is setting anyway, so it's fine. Oh my gosh. Can you just... There we go. Lovely, are you ready for bed? Yeah? I have a bone for you. Um, oh, one last thing. One last thing, you guys, before we go to bed that I wanted to share is I plan on... I just pinched my entire hand in that. <laughs> oh my gosh. You just gotta love it, you know? It's always fun over here. Okay, what I was saying <laughs> is um, I plan on doing a Q&A, like a 50-state road trip Q&A, and I'll probably do this every, I don't know, whenever I need to, whenever something changes, like every year or six months or I don't know. But seeing as we just started the 50-state road trip relatively, I figured why don't we do one at the beginning? So if you guys want to leave any questions you have in the comments below the next week i'll probably be filming a q a so you can ask me anything 50 state road trip related or not if you have a different question that doesn't pertain to that but you want to answer um also if you i plan on putting people's names who ask the question in the video so if you don't want your name in there just leave a note and i'll omit your name so right cool all right, me and Pupper Lou are gonna go to bed. So leave Oregon suggestions in the comments, leave your questions for the road trip Q&A in the comments, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Okay, bye. <laughs> Good job, Bubby. You're a pro. All right, let's go to bed. I gotta make sure there's no ticks on you, dude. I can't handle that. Yeah, I can't handle that. You know it. You know me. You know I'm gonna freak out. We gotta check you for ticks. Okay?